Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Leo. This is going to be your beginning to middle of June spread. All the information that you need to book a personal reading is going to be down below, and all the special announcements will be said at the end. Okay, so this is going to be for the lovely Leos for their beginning to middle of June spread. Let's see what's going on for you guys. So I see there's a need for balance in your life. You guys are feeling a little bit discontent because you're overly focused on like material things right now. For a lot of you, I just heard all work and no play. So for a lot of you, I see you may be overworking yourself and you're being asked to find this balance in like work and play. It's definitely time for you guys to have some fun. And actually, I'm seeing by letting yourself have some fun, it's going to be so much easier for you guys to find like creative solutions in your life, especially when it comes to like tackling daily tasks and especially when it comes to your work. I'm seeing news of an exciting new endeavor in your work and also like in your relationships as well. And this is something that you manifested. I see like whatever this new endeavor is, this is really going to like relight the fire in your soul. So confidently accept this opportunity that you're offered. I see this is going to be a successful time for you. But for a lot of you, I feel like you're so focused on work that you're not letting yourself enjoy your success. All these new positive opportunities that are coming towards you. And it's like your soul is feeling very adventurous right now. But for a lot of you, it's like you guys have work on your mind and it's stopping you from like enjoying your life. And you're being asked to take this leap of faith to follow your dreams, but also to follow your fun as well. Because I see you guys want emotional fulfillment, but it's like you're putting all of your focus into work. I feel like I'm talking to like a workaholic here. <laughs> and like you're being invited to fall in love with life again. My neighbors are having a party, so like, yeah, have some fun with life again. Celebrate. And it's like, when you guys make that time for yourself to play and have fun, this is really going to just like renew your overall sense of well-being. And it's like, when you go back to work, you're going to be having all these new ideas. You're going to come to work with more excitement. And your overall quality of work will improve. Yeah, your inner child is wanting to come out and play. But it's like when you're not at work, you guys are still thinking about work and then you guys feel guilty and you got to release that guilt and embrace this change in your life. Embrace this new balance and expect things to get better and allow yourself to go towards this new exciting opportunity coming your way. Because again, this is also going to bring renewed passion to your workplace as well. And this is actually going to lead to career advancement for you. It's time for you to change your life and release all that guilt, all that pressure you guys have been putting on yourself. Release all your negative thinking and bring healing to your inner child. Yeah, again, it's time for you guys to heal your inner child here. There's like this an illusion of being trapped in your job and you're being asked to have confidence and take action to create the life that you want to create. And have confidence and take action and go towards the things that bring you joy, the things that make you happy. Because you're going to feel so much better when you find this balance between work and play. And it's going to help manifest your dreams coming true even faster. 
So I definitely love that for you guys. And also we just had the full moon on the 26th, so if you guys are interested in playing a game to find out your full moon vibes, go head over to the community tab and look for the Furby in front of the red candle. There you guys will find your instructions on how to play and how to find out your full moon vibes. Okay, so some signs that popped up in here, I see Libra, Cancer, Capricorn, Gemini, Leo, Capricorn, Aries, Pisces, Pisces, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Pisces. Aries, Scorpio, Libra, Pisces. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. Make sure you check your chart. Whoever you're connecting with, go check out their chart too. And because we're officially in the age of Aquarius, we're getting the conversation started about aliens. Because this is definitely something you're going to be seeing and hearing a lot more of in the upcoming months. So if you have an open mind and an open heart, and you guys are interested in higher learning, higher consciousness, this definitely may be something that you might want to go check out. And the link for that video is going to be down below. And I'm a firm believer of know yourself to free yourself. So if you want to uncover your past lives and learn more about yourself, I made a past life guided meditation video for you guys to do just that. And the link is going to be down below. And check out my newest song called The Moon and Stars and the link for that is also going to be down below. And if you guys are interested in booking a personal reading with me, all the information that you need to do so is going to be down below. And make sure to go check out my Instagram and my TikTok. They both have the same at name, at CosmicTides underscore. I pull daily tarot cards, I share channeled messages, all that good stuff. And on my TikTok, I'm also doing readings over there too, as well as a lot of other fun stuff, so definitely go check that out. And you guys keep being great. I'll see you next week. Bye!